There's one thing I would like to say just briefly. When 1950, Di Vernon was brought over by Harry Stanley, that was a, one of the most famous and important people at that time. He was very successful in Europe. It was his first time he came over. And there are a few wonderful stories if you have his book of David Ben's wonderful biography. It's, it's not yet there because it's, it's the early years, but he will be in the second volume. David Ben here, hope you publish your second volume soon. <laughs> And, uh, and there, there is an anecdote which is, which is quite fantastic. He was sitting with friends, Louis Gans and Jack Avis, I think Alex Hemsley was with that. And Al Coran, the famous mentalist, walks in. And he was known to have a character, he, he didn't like to be fooled. So he goes up to Vernon in this round and says, Di, show me a trick that's fooled me. You can't show me a trick that fools me. Okay, and Di Vernon does a trick and it fools him terribly. He gets up, takes his coat goes out and doesn't come back. So that's a brief <laughs> anecdote. So can I ask Al Quran, who, who's a, a mentalist, who qualifies for a mentalist? Mal, would you qualify for a mentalist? Okay. He's not the stooge, but I, I know many people in the first row, so you have a nice round of applause for the gentleman. <laughs> if, you, if you will stand just uh, to my left, thank you very much. Welcome on stage. Piacere, Roberto, in italiano, si dice così. Also. And so, uh, here is the thing, that uh, they were smoking at that time, actually, if you see Dave Byrne, first famous, is always photographed with a cigarette. So there was a pack of cigarettes there, and um, he wrote a prediction on it. He wrote, before anything started, he wrote, I'm going to take a deck of cards so they don't smoke. And also for the youngsters, I have many young people here, uh, this is the, let's, please don't smoke at home, right? <laughs> Yes. In the street, the street is okay, but not at home. Yes. Uh, and now you don't get an applause. It's a joke, it's a joke. Don't smoke. Okay. Now here's my prediction. It's going to be yes, oh, you do like Al Quran, he was asked to take the cards and to thoroughly shuffle them. Shuffle like a mentalist shuffle. Yeah, there, there you are. There you go. And whenever you're happy, you stop shuffling. There you are. Put it away. But that's what he did, right? Square them, I don't want to touch them. Turn them a little bit over so they are, yes, Swiss precision, forgive me. And now Dave Vernon said, Al, you've shuffled the card and you have shuffled it. Mal. Oh, Mal, it's almost out. No, Mal, Mal. And he had nothing in his hand. He just turned over the top card. And what was it? The three of clubs. Do we have it? Three of clubs. Now, for sure, the rest of the cards were, of course, all different, all other cards, yes? Yes? Yes. And uh, would you please replay the situation as it was? I'll please see what they burn photo and show it here on the camera. What does it say? Three of clubs. Three of clubs. Exactly. <laughs> is that correct? <laughs> well, this is, and this, asked, they, this became the trick that cannot be explained. Right? Only that in this way, it really happened that way. You know, it really happened that way. So there you are. Uh, oh, jokers, you, you will get this as a little, if I may, sure. as a little gift. Et voila. <coughs> My compliments. You have three of clubs, yes? Yes, so you have a souvenir. <laughs> Thank you, Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I have.